guys, this is Tim from Modern Tech Reviews, and I've just started this YouTube blog. I wanted to have a channel where I can start to post different things about modern technology reviews, things that I find interesting, things that I think you might find interesting, and basically just to review technology in today's industry. Now what I'm planning to do with this first video is to show you my setup at home. Now this is my home office where I do a lot of my work. I do have a business aside from this vlog of course. I do a lot of work from home here for the business and this is my kind of home studio setup that I've got now and I've spent the better part of about four months getting this designed and tailored exactly how I want. And I'm very happy with it now and I thought I would just share with you a quick overview of what I have in my setup. What I have here is this desk is actually a custom made desk. It's eight feet long, about 30 inches deep, and it's huge. It's very big. I love it because I can, I can spread my work out on it and I can really get a lot more done. I feel more productive when I have this desk set up. And this is just a recent addition to my home office. On the top of my desk, you'll see that I've got two 34 inch ultra wide screen curved Dell monitors. They're beautiful. They work very, very well. That's my main screens that I use to run my system. Just behind those, I've got a pair of M-Audio BX5 studio monitor speakers, one on each side. Those obviously drive my sound system, and I've got those paired with a subwoofer by M-Audio, which is a BX subwoofer. That thing sounds amazing. Next, I've got this iMac computer back here. I don't really use it much right now, and I actually might get rid of it but I do have it, it's there in case I want to do some video editing or just some Mac work. But I do have a MacBook Pro which I primarily use for anything Mac related and even my video editing for now. So that may go away and I may even eventually get a third Dell monitor here to complete this collection. My main peripherals that I use, I've got a Logitech G910 gaming keyboard. Now that's a full LED RGB keyboard that was the primary reason why I bought it because I wanted to be able to change the colors. For me, it's just a fun thing to do. Completely not necessary, but I love to do it, so that's why I have it. I've also got the wireless Sensei mouse. It's by SteelSeries. This mouse is great, and it's also RGB. The mouse is sitting on a gaming mouse pad by Razer. It's the Razer Firefly. The only reason I bought this mouse pad is again for the RGB colors. I really like the look of it. It completed my desk setup very nicely and that's what I wanted so I went ahead and got it. Now at some point I may decide to get a, a single brand and switch all three components to one brand just so they match better. But for now I'm very happy with this setup and it looks great. Underneath my desk you'll see that I've got these three compartments. Now I have these custom built. These are just shelves where I can tuck all my things away. And I've got stuff wired so that there's really nothing on top of the desk except what I absolutely need. I've got my keyboard and mouse obviously and my monitors, but beyond that, all the stuff that I would need to access or get to or even extra wiring and cabling, I've got tucked down below so that it's kind of out of sight, out of mind. I personally like the clean look that it gives to this desk you'll see that there's very few or no wires that are visible on top of the desk. I've also got LED lighting on this desk. I put some under each speaker and there's also a strip going underneath the back of this desk. Mainly you see that at nighttime because it lights up the floor and behind the desk a little bit and of course I can change the colors. It's not the highest end, it's not a Philips Hue or anything like that. It is kind of an off-brand, a generic model if you will but it really serves the job that I wanted it to and it saved me a lot of money to just get it set up the way that I wanted. This, by the way, is my digital to analog converter. This is a Creative Lab Sound Blaster X G5. It's a very nice add-on to this whole setup. And one nice thing is that it gives me a couple of headphone jacks which are easily accessible instead of having to get down on the floor and plug into my computer. And last but not least, I've got my own custom gaming computer. That's what I use to run this whole setup and what I run my home office from. 
I'm not going to go into the specifications on this particular computer. I'm actually planning to upgrade it this year. It is a few years old, but it is a very nice computer and it gets the job done and I'm very happy with it. So that's my quick overview of what I've got and how I've set up my home office. This is primarily where I'm going to be shooting my YouTube videos, at least for now. I plan to do most of my tech reviews from here. This is my home office setup. This is where I make money. I am very productive here. This allows me to work from home in a comfortable environment, listen to music like I want, and do the things that I need to do right here in my home office. Just to add a little bit to the end of this video, my plans with this channel are to post modern technology reviews. I want to grab a wide variety of different things and review them on here. And I'm going to pick random things, things that seem interesting to me, things that I think might be interesting to you, and just try to grab technology and give my own personal viewpoint and take and reviews on different pieces of technology out there. I've had a lot of experience over the years with different types of technology from entertainment to computers to just about anything you can think of. And I plan to just have a variety of different reviews posted on this channel. So guys, if you like this video, I'd appreciate if you'd click the like button below. And if you want to subscribe to this channel to watch for any new updates that I put, any reviews that I'm posting, go ahead and do so and you'll be alerted to it. So stay tuned for more videos for Modern Tech Reviews.